your friends are still looking in like Seventeen magazine and they're looking at you know the beauty columns and the like little things that you should be looking at not high fashion things that are somewhat provocative there's no way that you're ready to see yourself in a magazine no matter how mature you are no matter how much you've gone through in your life there's absolutely no way you're thrown in it, into it so fast that you're, you don't you don't have room to grow up and I feel like my childhood was somewhat um, affected by the industry just because I was subject to so many things I wouldn't have been subject to until much later. You're just used to your mom and your dad telling you how great you are all the time and your teacher is giving you good marks. Sometimes I would just go home and just be like, I have no chance. All these girls are so much older, they know what they're doing, they aren't getting the criticism that I'm getting. When you're so young, you're not used to comparing yourself as much to other people and obviously in high school, it's all about who has the biggest boobs, who has the nicest ass, whatever. In modeling, it's the complete opposite. It's more um, who has, I don't know, like the clearest skin, or who has the longest legs, who has the smallest longest waist, hair. longest hair. It's not just like, oh, slow, slowly getting into it. It's just all of a sudden you're signed. This is what we need from you. I was the baby of the group. Everybody knew that, and I was just this little girl with all these, like, 17, 18 year olds, and, um, to be compared to somebody that was older than me, and to be told to dress like them, and look like them, and pose like them, and just present yourself exactly like another girl that I was friends with, that was the most heartbreaking thing I think for me. You're so ready, you're walking in the to the to the industry, to the office and you're just so wow, I look good today, I'm happy, my hair is perfect. Oh, why don't you dress like her? Or <laughs> why don't you present yourself like her? Why don't you cut your hair like her? Can't can't I just be myself instead of trying to be like this girl who's been very successful in the industry? And obviously she was she's gorgeous and blah, blah blah. Everyone was already jealous of her, anyways. So just that little kick in the butt was really hurtful for all of us. But yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs>